Customizing the default 2011 WordPress theme. How do we move the bullets you see with the sidebar links? Well, let me show you what I'm talking about. Let me scroll down here a little bit. This is your sidebar, and these are some of the links that I was referring to. And with most links, leastways here in the meta section, you've got these bullets here. Now, you can customize these, but hey, that's info for another video. Right now, I want to show you how you can get rid of them. And what I'm referring to is like this. So let's go ahead and take a look at the code that we're going to use to do this. Now it's pretty simple. There's not really much to this that can be customized. It's just a matter of now you see it, now you don't. So you just add this code to your style.css like I'm about to show you here. Now I'm going to be using my child theme style.css. Let's go ahead and open that up now. And I'll just paste that right in here. And if you do not yet have a child theme, then you could just paste this same code at the very bottom of your parent theme, style.css. Let's go ahead and save that, open up my FTP client. And while I'm talking here, I could also go ahead and mention that you can just do all of the same editing within your WordPress dashboard under appearance. Here, let me show you real quick. Let me first upload this and overwrite the existing style.css. Again, that's in my child theme. Let's close out the FTP client and my Notepad++ text editor and my code. And let's log into our dashboard here. And in the Appearance sub-panel, if you just come on down here to Editor, let me move this up some, come on down here to Editor. Again, that's in the Appearance sub-panel. And then you want to just open up your style.css into the editing window and then right at the bottom of your style.css you would just paste that code. Of course you can see that mine's already here that I just did through the text editor on my computer and then uploaded and overwritten the existing style.css through my FTP client. Now let's come on back here and now you see them. Refresh the page and now you don't. And that's how you can remove the bullets that are associated with the links within your sidebar.